the Don Trees mat comes at under $20. Here is my review about it. The mat comes inside this round paper cylinder package. Inside comes the mat rolled up and a clip wrapping strap for on the go. For under $20, you get a lot of matte surface. You can also choose two colors, a light gray or a dark gray, two different sizes as well. The one I am reviewing is the extra large size measuring 39 inches in length, 15 inches wide, and 0.12 inches thick, or similar to two coins stacked flat on top of each other. The material is called felt cloth and is smooth and soft to the touch. Underneath, there is a nice non-slip rubber pattern. The rubber does not stick like glue, so with some force, the mat will slide a bit. But for casual productivity and gaming, there is plenty of grips to prevent sliding. And just a reminder, if you are currently liking the video so far, please give this video a like and consider subscribing to my channel for more future videos. Now let's talk about some pros about the mat. First thing, the size. There is plenty of keyboard and mouse surface. Second thing is the color. Does not show wrist movement usage stains compared to how a black mouse pad does. The third thing would be the non-slip rubber underneath doing a great job to keep the mat in place. The last thing would be it makes a great tabletop protector from scratches, spills, and heat in solution. Now let's talk about the cons about this mat. The only negative thing I have about this product is the material. I know I mentioned the material felt smooth and soft to the hand. The smoothest of the material is different when it comes to using a mouse. I tried my gaming mouse which is the Logitech G502. While moving the mouse throughout the mat, I felt a consistent small resistance preventing smooth movement. As you can see, the G502 is ranking off pieces of lint off the mat. I tried my other mouse, which is the Logitech Master MX3. As you can see, it moves with ease and no lint is being ranked off. So just keep in mind that certain mouses are not going to have smooth movement. I fixed this by putting my old mouse pad on top. To be honest, I thought it was going to be uncomfortable because of the increase in height. They actually made it more comfortable for my wrist while gaming and productivity work. I would recommend this mat to anyone looking for a cheap extra large desk mat to add more of a aesthetic look to their desk setup. I would not suggest this if you are planning to use it for gaming, especially if you have a G502 mouse. There you have it. That was my review of the Don Trees mat. All items mentioned in this video will be in the description below. If you like this video, please go ahead and hit the like button to help the channel out. And consider subscribing for more future videos. I will see you next time whenever I post another video. Thanks for watching.